Once you've logged into Ramp, you're ready to upload your chart of accounts. You'll first need to export your chart of accounts from your accounting provider. Next, you'll find the accounting page on the navigation bar and click into the page. You'll notice that you can either click Get Started or you can designate another team member to help set this up. This team member will need to have the admin or bookkeeper permission set within Ramp. Next, you'll click Get Started. Below, you'll see the other providers. If you don't see your provider listed up top, you can search and type in the name of your provider. Once you've accessed this provider, you'll click into their name. This will bring you to a page where first, you'll start by importing your chart of accounts. If you don't already have your chart of accounts, you can use our template to help ensure that you don't miss any key fields. Once you've downloaded your chart of accounts from your accounting provider, we recommend that you remove duplicates from this list. You can either delete the duplicates or you can rename those duplicates. You will not be able to upload a chart of accounts that contains duplicates into Ramp and you will receive an error message if you try to do so. Next, you'll press the Upload Completed Template and drag and drop your CSV or Excel spreadsheet file here. This file should include the columns, segment ID, and name. Once you've uploaded the chart of accounts, you can press Save and Continue. Below that, there are two optional steps. You can always go back and configure these later via accounting settings. First, if you would like to import your vendor list, you can do so. Again, you'll see a template that helps you get started. Once you've completed this, you can upload your CSV or Excel spreadsheet. Lastly, you're able to import additional fields. You'll start by naming your field, and then you'll select if it's a single select field or a text field. These are going to be additional fields for coding purposes on the transaction level. If you would like to ensure that all transactions have this field filled out, you will select Required for Export. This means that no transactions are able to be exported unless these fields have values. Once you've imported these, you are connected and have uploaded your Universal CSV to Ramp. 